my first time at the edge, my first time in Brazil. I'm very happy to be here. I'm looking forward to playing in a bit. I'm not sure how it's going to go down, but we're going to have fun. Uh, a new single on Tiny Sticks with remixes from Mark E and Invincible Scum and then after that we have our debut single on DFA which is uh, a new track we've done with a singer called Gavin Gordon um, and then after that we are working on an album which we hope to release next spring uh, and that's it, that's it for the moment I guess our first proper single was Black Jump. Prior to that, we'd done a few re-edits and uh, a couple of remixes, but Black Jump was our first single on Tiny Sticks. Uh, and after that, we did um, we did a single called K Choppers on DFA's imprint called Death From Abroad. And uh, after that, we did another single called Beat Up and Lucky on Tiny Sticks. And that was the first time we used the singer Gavin Gordon who uh, we're working with now to do the album. I think we've kind of we've got thrown into the to the pot that is new disco. Uh, we're happy to be there, but we're not strictly exclusively disco orientated. We we draw influences from all all over. Um, but of course, we love disco. But we love old house, funk, and soul, and psychedelic. Uh, so yeah, we have a very broad reference. We like to. Um, we like all music. Who doesn't? I read about Lycra Virgin. What's that? <laughs> uh, well, uh, Lycra Virgin was the... I think it was the first thing we... One of the first things we ever did. And it was uh, obviously Madonna's Lycra Virgin, which we re-edited. And uh, we pressed up and, and released on 12-inch. And um, that kind of got us a lot of recognition people from James Murphy to Era Alcan um, yeah it kind of put us on the map but when I listen to it now it's a bit embarrassing I don't really like it but it helped us <laughs> <laughs> 